Good afternoon, one and all. Uh, this is our team Phoenix 5. We are from BVRIT College. And our prototype is uh, guides and eyewear. Uh, the idea is to develop or design uh, spectacles which is useful to the blind people uh, to identify the traffic signals while crossing the roads and some paperwork like uh, bills in order to avoid a betrayal. Uh, example, we choose to choose blind people. They are unable to cross the roads. So, okay, announcements are not. near traffic signals, there are announcements. Leo. So, we came up with the idea that okay, like smart uh, glasses. Laga. In this, we use some sensors to identify the signals and uh, and uh, the problems that are facing by the blind people are uh, in supermarkets and in internet uh, traffic signals. In supermarkets, if you purchase 500 pete, I purchase 600. Then 1000 rupees note So 500 no, 500 rupees wal man kivali. Kani walu okay blind people ka dhani they can do manipulate. So alava kuna underan ki we use a sensors and in internet uh, in some of the websites they cannot uh, access the content because uh, it is not translatable from a braille language to the and english and near traffic signals they cannot uh, cross the roads so over to the team Good afternoon, good afternoon everyone as supriya covered some of the problems let us see where are the situations the problems are occurred but the first considered situation is road crossing. As you said, uh, blind people cannot cross the road in their own. They need some individual supports or some other announcement, something else. So they should be independent to do their works. So we are trying to invent something to help them. And the second situation where their problem is transport. So if they want to go from one place to another place, they need someone's support for sure. Even if they know the place or don't know, they need an individual support. So if they have some, uh, some uh, assistance or something else, they can travel easily and they, they don't need any other support. They don't need to rely on someone else. And the third situation is libraries. If they want to read any books, they may, they may not find all the books in Braille. And even in the Braille library, they may not find the books they wanted to read. And next one is navigations. If they want to navigate to a new place for them, for any other work, they cannot go to the place. So the idea we have got is to build, to, to design spectacles which, have, which, have, which will be having two sensors. One will be sensing, recognizing the text, that is numbers or bills, something like that. And the other will be lights, like in the traffic signals, red, yellow and green. So according to the signals, they can, it's, it, uh, it says them to go or stop something like that. And these, these sensors also work some paperwork like bills or currency notes to know the value of the notes. Thanks. Now Kiran Mai will continue. Sensors. Before going to this topic, I would like to ask you one question. When you go to any supermarket or a shopping mall, first what will you do? shopping you'll you'll pick what you want and you'll go to the counter and you'll take then the person will give you the bill then you'll see the bill and pay the money to them but in case of uh, blind people if they go to shopping or uh, any supermarket alone they couldn't uh, they they are unable to find the money so they are unable to know the know the price of what they bought so, in this case, they may be cheated by the shopkeepers. So, we came up with uh, some sensors, which will be like, uh, first, one will, first one is USB camera sensor. Here, this sensor will, uh, this sensor will scan the text and uh, that text will be converted into digital format by this 
converted to digital format using some software or uh, any setup. And this is, this is also very feasible to scan the text. Now my friend will continue. Okay, good afternoon everyone. As my friend said about the introduction to the sensors, now I'll go, I'm going to tell about the RGB sensor. Okay, what is the purpose of this uh, sensor? This sensor we are using in our product or a prototype because this sensor detects the traffic lights and gives the output as a generator, audio output it gives. Uh, we use this, for example, whenever a blind person is trying to cross the road, he can cross the road only when the traffic signal is red. But how could he know? Using this sensor, he can know it. Whenever this sensor detects the light and gives the audio that uh, the signal is red, so you can't cross. So whenever the signal is green, he can cross and he can go safely. So this is about a sensor. Now my friend will continue. As my friend said, uh, USB and RGB, uh, USB uh, it, it declares the text and RGB is uh, light. They both these uh, these two sensors uh, generate the process and these devices can process the data from the sensors and generate the audio. And the, I'll show you the prototype. These two are both sensors RGB and USB and this is the audio which, generate, which generates the output, this is speaker. These are, these are the two sensors, USB and RGB and this is the final generate audio. Thank you guys.